I'd had a brand new one. But listen. Praise him. Praise him. And I'm quoting scripture. We believe in praising the Lord. Not merely with our lips giving thanks to his name or offering a sacrifice of praise to God continually. I believe we should. And I believe even people that aren't saved ought to be praising the Lord. Because the Bible said that everything that have breath. Praise the Lord, you ought to be praising him because you have breath. And David said, I will praise the Lord now, henceforth and forevermore. But he said, the dead, the dead praise not the Lord. Do they praise the Lord where you go to church? It could be they're all dead. That's why they don't praise the Lord. But David, this brother David Mangum, one of our youngest workers, praise the Lord on these symbols. Some of you may say, is that gospel? Well, of course it's gospel. What did you think it was? Sound, that sounds like rock and roll. Ah, that, that's real soul gospel music. But as Brother Martin once in a while says, he believes in rock and roll. In a sense, I do too. David put a rock in a slingshot and roll the giant. So bless God. Here's a great album that's just taken the country almost by storm. And it's one of our latest and one of our greatest. Gospel organ, David Davis style. And this is David Davis over here at the Hammond organ. We believe that if he isn't the greatest, he's one of the greatest, but I'm just kind of partial. If there was anyone any greater than he is on the organ, I, I'd have them here. But he's not an organist that comes in here and plays for the Sunday morning service or the Sunday night service and goes off and smokes cigarettes between numbers and sips cocktails and guzzles beer and tells nasty, filthy jokes. All our workers are spirit-filled and saved and have the joy of the Lord in their hearts. Amen. This, this is why our telecast are so anointed and blessed of God. And I'm going to ask David tonight to play one number on this great album. This plays almost an hour in your home. And uh, there's a six, there's a dozen great numbers on it. Now, if you don't like this kind of gospel music, don't write me a letter. But aren't you tired of that old dead funeral stuff? Yeah. Well, by the way, he could play that, but not very much of it. I don't want you to kill my revival. should have on something long and black, shouldn't I? Well, I'll tell you, I always wear black clothes at a funeral, but there's nobody dead around here. We're all alive. We have the joy of the Lord in our hearts. Go on and praise the Lord. So David, what are you going to play? I am on the Lord's side.
believe what God has commanded us to do. David said, praise him on the organs. That means more than one. Praise him on the high-sounding cymbals. Praise him on the stringed instruments. Do you remember back in the old days when, can you play that old-fashioned four notes at a time? something more about music in the church in a few moments. But David said, Wilt thou not revive us again? Revive us again, that thy people may rejoice in thee? A revival is nothing more than God coming down in the midst of his people and blessing his people until they can shout and have old-fashioned joy again. Now, I know you like this kind of music. Multitudes of people listen to our broadcast every day across the nation and uh, tuned to channel after channel every Sunday morning uh, to catch this music and to listen to our choir and to watch what God is doing on their TV sets. And listen, many, many, I dare say thousands of people not only tuned to this channel or many other channels every Sunday to see God heal the sick, to hear us preach because we believe we have some of the greatest preachers in the world under our big tent. And in these auditorium campaigns, well, we have some of the best music. Why don't you write me this week for this great album? It's gospel organ, David Davis style. David, could you just play me just a few bars of when the saints go marching in? <laughs> this week for this great album. Now, albums similar to this, pressed on Pure Vinyl Unbreakable, they almost an hour in your home, cost up to $4 and more in your music store. And out here in the vestibule and across the nation, our recordings sell for $3. But if this week you'll just enclose an offering in your letter and let us know you appreciate this telecast, which is a great work of faith and we're dependent entirely on people just like you to pay our TV bills. Because you see, they don't give this to us as a public service. Mm -hmm. We have to pay for every moment of it. So enclose your gift of appreciation and ask this week for gospel organ and have this old-fashioned gospel music in your home. And now, here's Gene Martin, the Miracle Valley Choir, and they're singing, Christ is the answer. <laughs>
Yes, Lord. You enjoying this? Now, you may think this uh, telecast has a lot of commercials. It does have. You watch any other show and you'll see one every few minutes. But we don't have any soap. We don't have any wax. We're not selling detergents. Just Jesus. His blessing, his power, salvation for the soul and healing for the body. And you need this kind of music in your home. Here is a great album made in the great Philadelphia tent campaign. And it's called Restoration Revival Alive. I believe it to be one of the greatest albums we have ever pressed. We'll play almost an hour. It's revival from beginning to end on both sides. Prayer for the sick, miracles right in the midst of this kind of singing. People that are totally blind come screaming and shouting, I can see, I can see. People jumping out of wheelchairs that hadn't walked for years, declaring, look at me, I'm walking on a cloud. What happened? In the midst of old-fashioned restoration revival, God healing the sick without one prayer being prayed and without us laying a hand on a person. And if you want this revival in your home, write me this week. As for restoration, Revival Alive, our meeting address, the Allen Revival Telecast, Miracle Valley, Arizona. And here's Gene and the choir again. They're singing, It Is Well, I believe Brother David Davis is taking the lead.
just a question. Are you in bondage to alcohol, narcotics, dope, drugs? Write this week for this great 32-page bulletin with conclusive evidence that you and your loved ones can stop, can quit tobacco, alcohol, narcotics, or dope without medical attention without medicines, without drugs, without surgery, without crack cures, and without hypnosis. 32 pages edited by some of the greatest personalities in the nation with conclusive evidence there is help for you. And if you need help, just address an envelope to H-E-L-P, help. Everybody shout help. You need help, and you can get help. Just address an envelope to the Allen Revival telecast, Miracle Valley, Arizona, and say, please send me. It's yours this week for the asking. And since this is the summer camp meeting, bring me that big chest of prayer requests, brother. From across the nation, thousands of people have mailed in requests. And we have girls on the long distance telephone lines here at Miracle Valley to take all your long-distance telephone calls that have come in from people around the world requesting prayer for loved ones that are dying, loved ones that are unsaved. We have a Miracle Million prayer band as well as people under the tent and in these auditorium meetings that join hands in prayer. Night after night, hundreds of people are fasting and praying and laying hands on your requests. And remember, if you're sick, if you're diseased, and if you're afflicted and need help, you need healing, in your letter to me, let us know what your need is. Tonight, prayer will go up all night long over these requests. And if you have written us the last three weeks, your letter is in this chest. And if you haven't written, write me a letter. Because there's trouble everywhere today. And another great publication, Miracle Magazine now is being read by millions every month. No charge. Your subscription is paid for. It will come to you every month, complimentary of the great church here at Miracle Valley. And if your name isn't on the mailing list, say, Brother Allen, put my name on the subscription list of Miracle Magazine. Generally 32 pages in full color. Pictures before and after of all the great things that God is doing worldwide in the greatest revival the world has ever and will ever know. And now, before we leave your channel, here's Gene Martin, the Miracle Valley Choir, to sing, Troubles in a Land Will Soon Be Over. Do you believe that? Yeah. Do you believe the troubles will soon be over? Yeah. If you'll invite Jesus in your heart, Jesus in your home, he can put a stop to your troubles now. And we're dedicating this to every one of you who are having troubles, physical troubles, sickness. Write me a letter and tell me your need. As for the book, God will heal you. Thousands have been healed in their home as faith is generated in their heart, and they read this. Multitudes have said, Brother Allen, while I read the book, God healed me. It's yours for your letter of appreciation this week. Just ask for God will heal you. And, oh, by the way, just a moment, Gene. Just now on the press here at Miracle Valley, coming off by the hundreds of thousands, Send Now Prosperity, my newest and latest book with conclusive scriptural evidence that God wants to prosper you. And if you're bound by poverty or having trouble with an empty pocketbook or your bank account's gone empty and you don't have a job and the devil's beating you in the corner, write for this book. If you don't declare it's the greatest book you have ever read, and if it doesn't open the windows of heaven and pull you out a blessing, a financial blessing, so big according to the third chapter of Malachi, you can't receive it, tear the front cover off and mail it back to me and say, Brother Allen, you've misrepresented your new book. But when you write, as for sin now, prosperity and your troubles, your financial troubles can come to an end.
for this week and ask for this great album. Mailing address, the Allen Revival telecast, Miracle Valley, Arizona. And if you're faithful this week with your letter, your generous letter, we'll be happy to come right back into your home again next week over the same channel at this same hour. But if you don't write, you may miss us next Sunday. But you enjoy this, don't you? If you enjoy it, shout yeah. yeah. And you that are shouting yes out here, will have an opportunity to give your offering for this tonight. And you can mail yours, and Uncle Sam will bring it to us. We can get it in two days after you drop it in the mail, and I'll be looking for your letter. That's the Allen Revival Telecast, Miracle Valley, Arizona. <laughs> Special letters, telegrams, and prayer requests to Evangelist A. A. Allen, Miracle Valley, Arizona. Your generous letter is needed today. And don't forget, his mailing address is Evangelist A. A. Allen, Miracle Valley, Arizona.